Uh, hello, uh, my name is Professor Iris Benzi. I'm a Chair Professor of Biomedical Science here at PolyU and I've been asked to share my thoughts on a very interesting question of how teachers can help the next generation of thought leaders excel. Uh, and that's a very challenging question. But I think if we think about the qualities of the next generation of leaders, they need to be independent but they need to also be able to work with other people. They need to be able to communicate very well. They need to be resilient. They need to be resourceful. They need to be able to cope with failure in order to be adaptable and to keep on going and develop that resilience that is very, very necessary. So in order to teach students how to cope and develop these skills and to become the next generation of leaders, then we need to help them develop these skills of communication. We need to allow them to be independent and go their own way to a certain extent. We need to allow them to work in teams as well as being independent. And we need to be sometimes tough in order that they know their performance isn't good enough. Coping with failure is something that happens in life. It's not to fail people unnecessarily, but if you don't succeed the first time, then you have to learn to cope with that and either do something better or different change your approach or redo things. That is a very important life skill as I have learned to my cost and to my benefit. So there are many, many things. Resilience, perseverance, resourcefulness, communication skills, teamwork, independence and being responsible for your own progress through your career and through your life. I saw something very interesting recently on a TV, just an advertisement, and uh, someone said the most important project in your whole life is your own life and that is very important and there's no one else can live your life for you but yourself. As teachers we might be able to help you to be equipped for the future but the future is unknown and it's up to you to make your way through it.